Alright. Are they going to do both? No, they're teleporting exactly one on board into our uh, med bay. This is not going to go very well for them. They teleported into one of the dumbest places they possibly could have teleported to. Other than that missile, I don't see them uh, being very dangerous. Also, we apparently killed that guy. I'm surprised. Alright, Martin Lawrence, get back over there. Somehow we have managed to uh, take this out pretty quickly here. I'm happy with the results. Alright. Drone parts, missiles, and scrap. We need less drone parts and more fuel at this point. Okay, I'm going to continue trying to go through as much of this nebula as possible. Seeing if we can't find some more stuff. There are a number of small stations for travelers in the area, lit up by guiding lights and advertisements. Only slug ships are docked, so we decide it's better to avoid a confrontation and steer clear. Come on, we've got slug members. We should be able to go and check them out. Oh, another store. At the very least, that will be, um, some fuel. A slug vessel that we encounter here has obviously made a big score and is looking to test its new armaments. They picked the wrong ship to attack. Alright, so these guys have some serious missiles here. That might be a uh, dual missile launcher there. I'm pretty sure that's a Pegasus. We've only got two people on board. I like being able to see stuff. That's pretty cool. Not very helpful at the moment, but I do like being able to see stuff. Oh, missile. Uh, it was not a double missile, but that is a very strong missile. Come on, take that shield down. There we go. Now we need to get rid of these weapons before that shield comes back up. Come on. Oh, hey, they're burning in there. You have bested us. Will you accept what's in our stores in exchange for our lives? Yeah, yeah, I think I think we can do that and, and see if they've uh, got anything good. Let's let them live. All right, take this newly developed weapon we're transporting. They're not going to be happy we gave it up, that is for sure. We don't want the weapon, we want information. We ask where they were delivering the weapon. By telling you, we'll probably die just as like as not. Oh well. They give us they give us the uh, coordinates of the prototype cruiser's mobile construction platform. They have added a quest marker to the next sector. Awesome. All right then. Let's go check out this store and uh Grab some fuel, because we're going to need it. We cautiously approach a slug colony on a huge asteroid. It's a brave person who sets foot on a slug planet. It can take weeks to get the mucus out of your clothes, but there's business to be done. Yes, indeed. I don't really care about that, don't care about that, and uh, don't care about that. Nothing is here at all that I want except for fuel. Give me all the fuel you got. Alright, let's see. What else do I want to start upgrading here? I'm going to start working on engines at this point. So let's move on. I'm going to head towards the exit now because we've got a quest to go for. There are a few more vicious beasts in the galaxy than a slug with his back to the wall. The faltering ship at this beacon disables our door systems and then charges fire weapons. They're gonna burn us out. Okay, well, he's got one fire weapon, but um, if we're lucky, he might not be able to make it through our shields in time. 
we'll see what we can do here. Give me the luck. All right, so far, lucky. Why don't you shoot that weapon before your other thing goes, uh-oh. Whew. I was kind of worried about that, but it, it went off okay so far. All right. Take out their weapons before they, uh, oh man, they're getting their shields back. Whatever, let's try and hit their weapons. Sweet. Not perfect, but uh, we should be able to kill them now. So it won't matter very much. There we go. Try and shoot while your ship breaks apart, asshole. Thanks for the fuel and scrap. Much appreciated. Also, I don't know why he didn't even put the uh, extra power in here that I got. I should have. Whatever. Continuing on towards this exit. A slug transport ship is stationed near the beacon with a military escort ship. They message us. We have been waiting for a customer for ages. Care to see our wares? Hmm. This doesn't seem like a good idea either way. They've got dangerous weapons. Um, we're gonna decline. Oh well, we shall wait here then. We cautiously put distance between our ship before preparing to jump. Yeah, I don't know, that seemed fishy. Let's get out of here. Damn slugs. We've arrived at the long range bacon. Yum yum. We've detected a rebel automated scout making or attacking a small refueling outpost. Let's intervene because I could use some fuel. We detect, or, uh, detecting the higher threat, the automated ship moves in to engage us. Now we can actually see on board their ship. That's awesome. All right, well, target their shields and try to get rid of them as soon as possible. I wish I could power this up even more. It would be really nice. Really, really nice. Well, at the very least, they're missing us. Yeah, slice and dice. <laughs> that was lucky. It went across the entire ship. I was not expecting to get slice and dice that easily. Okay. Well, that works for me. Got some missiles, drone parts, and scrap. We uh, get hailed by the outpost after the scout is destroyed. Thanks for the help. We've been harassed nonstop by those scouts. Take this on the house. I, uh, you're a fuel depot. Where, where's, aw. All right, well, whatever. Next sector it is, the civilian sector. Artillery Mastery, Federation Cruiser Type B, awesome. So basically, uh, we have gotten to the fifth sector here, which means that we uh, unlocked the B class of this ship. Sweet, so now we can start upgrading the weapons. Welcome to a new sector, get to the exit, uh, beacon, and jump to the next sector before the pursuing rebels catch us. All right, well, now that we have uh, been able to get this far, I'm gonna start upgrading the weapons here. And uh, now we will have the ability to use that uh, that glaive beam and start powering things up too. So I can take two out of this and use the glaive beam. You know what, I might just do that. That seems interesting to try out on the next ship. There's our quest. Let's go for it. I want that quest. Want to know what it is. All right. Um oh, this guy has 3 shields. Well, we wouldn't have made it through with the burst laser either, so whatever. An especially well-armed pirate approaches us. Hand over one of your crew members and the rest of you can go free unharmed. We'll never surrender one of our crew members to slavers. All right, this guy is gonna teleport aboard. Hopefully he'll teleport into our uh, med bay because that will make him awfully in trouble. No, he didn't. 
not an important spot, but I would like to uh, take these guys out before they do much damage to us. Alright, we'll have you two get in there. Bring you over. There's no need for our slugs to be so separated at this point. I suppose I could teleport over there, but I don't think that's a wise idea because they do have a lot of people on board their ship. They don't have a health station though, so it might be an okay idea. Alright, where are you hitting? That looks like that's an EMP, so I don't really care too much about that. And we hit him a bit. Our glaive beam would be able to uh, strike through because they've only got one shield going right now. Let's see, how far does this go? That is not a very long beam. That is not a very long beam at all. I think though that we can manage to hit all of this stuff. Yeah, right about there. So we'll let our glaive beam do a little bit of damage. Man, that thing looks huge! Alright, it's trying to power up its FTL, but it's currently delayed. So far, so good. And they have come back to their ship. Alright, we'll put you two in there. And we'll have you working on the weapons for the moment. And you can work on repairing our oxygen. Alright. Hopefully we'll be able to uh, finish destroying them before they manage to get away. Ouch. I didn't think that was going to get through. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We surrender! Take one of our slaves! Alright, um, this would probably hit two things, so it would kill them. So we could either take a slave or say surrender is not an option and hope that they don't jump before they die. Let's try it. Surrender is not an option. Yes! Alright, we got two missiles, one drone part, and 50 scrap. I don't think we have enough room for... Okay, we did have enough room for one more crew member, so... I could have done something with that. But, um... That's fine. I prefer getting more... Monetary gain. Let's see what we can find at the shop here. Anything cool? A transmission from the nearby planet indicates an outpost below which offers supplies to travelers. We send a... We send down an away party to check it out. And they've got some nice looking stuff. Ooh. Ooh. Damn, I want that. <laughs> Somehow I need to come back and get this because I don't have enough money right now for this. Okay, I gotta save my money. So I gotta come back and get that. Let's go to this quest. See what this is. Maybe we'll get some scrap out of it. We arrived to discover an impressive cruiser being worked on by a few smaller ships and guarded by an assault ship. The mobile construction platform is slowly slipping into the clouds. We've not yet been noticed. Alright, well, let's, um... I guess we'll probably uh, charge at them before they escape. As we approach, the assault ship swoops in on an intercept trajectory. Prepare for a fight. Man, this guy looks pretty epic. And he's got cloaking. This guy is dangerous. Three shields and all. Alright, we're gonna have to hope that... Oh boy, that our artillery beam does some good damage here to the shields, otherwise our glade beam is going to be useless. Oh, missiles. Alright, well, I think we hit him. And we hit him in the shields. Now, let's see if we can hit them more. Can I shoot up here? Um... Aw, there's got to be a way to do this. Yeah, i got to hit their shields first to do the most damage. Alright, go for it. 
That did less damage than I was hoping for, and our oxygen is down. Also, why don't you switch back here and we'll have this other slug help repair. Oh man, we are taking some serious damage here. We just need to survive, man! Just need to survive! Sweet. Alright, well, that seems to have uh, knocked a hole in our ship. I'll have you go and heal up there. Alright, we're doing some good damage. Glaive beam is down. Might as well switch to this. Try to hit their shield. They only have one more hit point at this point. Oh boy. Damage taking much of it. Okay. Usopp seems okay so far. Go ahead and bring him over here. Alright. With the assault of the ship taken care of, we turn our attention to the construction platform. However, we find that it has long since disappeared into the clouds. Ah, crap! Ah, uh, we scrap what we can and prepare to move on. I should have followed them sneakily, shouldn't I have? Damn, I lost that. So that was actually the ship that we could have gotten there. That was my bad. I picked the wrong one. I forgot which one it was. But we got a drone repair out of it. Yeah, that's not so good. Well, that blows. That indeed blows a lot. Because we lost uh, a ship out of that that we could have gotten. Oh well. Oh well. I was getting too eager there. That was my bad. Alright, we'll put you back in here. Heal you up. And heal you up. Oh, poor me. No ship. We almost had another new ship. That could have been awesome. But I screwed it up. Dang it. Alright. Well. We need to get that weapon pre-igniter because that would really help out. Oh, sun. Nope. You know what? We're just going to die. We're just going to die because everything sucks. <laughs> We arrive at the beacon and find ourselves dangerously close to a star. We're about to die. Yeah, this is not going to uh, go well at all for us. Nope. Not happening. Yeah. I don't think we're making it out of this alive. This, came, this became a very unlucky run all of a sudden. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. So good for so long, and then nothing. Oh, that's gonna do damage. We're gonna die. Okay, maybe we're not gonna die. But the fire's gonna come, and then it's going to really suck. Yep, here we go. Here we go. I think I can hit all of these. Just if I get it on the corner there, I think that'll work. That's not going to even do anything because they've got the uh, the three shields. Eh, guess I'll wait. It's not going to matter because we're going to burn out in a second here. Yeah, we're dead. Not even going to uh, survive this. Not happening. Because any one of my systems burns out, then we've got one hit point left. This is a very, very bad scenario currently. Let's get you in here too. Yep, we're dead. Very good situation turned into a very bad situation real quick. Oh well. You know... You win some, you lose some, and then you really lose some. <laughs> oh man, I could have had another ship. That would have been awesome. Oh well. 
So we got a uh, slice and dice with the pizza here. We also got the uh, get to sector 5 in the Federation cruiser without upgrading our weapon system, which is nice. And we've got the uh, B version of this. So we can use that next time. Awesome. Now to uh, go on and get more stuff and hopefully not die miserably in the future. Oh man, there was good stuff there and I just screwed it up real bad. Oh well. See you later, everyone.